You have a child struggling to pay attention and get things done. You are worried about your child and want to see him or her succeed and be happy. There's nothing worse than watching your child struggle and feeling helpless and not knowing what to do. You probably tried some things or maybe you're going to and here's why they don't work. They rely on methods that don't address the root problem. They don't teach your child how to use their own resources to focus and they are only temporary and don't last. I feel your pain because I have worked with thousands of children who needed help just like yours. Meet Caleb. In this video, I will show you the key to how Caleb transformed his life and went from smart but scattered to laser focus in realizing his potential. And then I'm going to show you how your child can do the exact same thing. If your child can learn, then they can learn how to improve their attention and follow through by doing neuroplasticity exercises. This is a bold statement, but it works. I felt there must be more that could be done, so I put a program together to help children just like Caleb. See if you can relate to this. Caleb's key to overcoming his attention problems was doing a brain map. The brain map showed an excessive amount of slow power in his frontal lobes. The slow activity compromised his brain performance. In my hunch, this is exactly what is happening with your child's brain. In fact, approximately 80% of the children we see like Caleb have the slow power in their brains. I would be willing to bet your child is one of them. And the reason I know this is because slow power was the root cause of Caleb's attention and procrastination problems. We taught Caleb how to speed up his neurons with our brain training program so he could focus better. For Caleb, faster neurons meant higher performance. Imagine what this might be like for your child to have higher performance. Caleb had to control our computerized program with his brain. Over the course of approximately four months, he transformed his brain. What I'm about to show you can happen for your child in the next four months. Take a look at his before and after brain maps. On the left, the excessive slow activity is reflected by the yellow and red areas in the frontal portions of his brain at baseline. On the right is Caleb's results after completing our brain training program. The absence of yellow and red areas indicate that he sped up his brain and that he is now functioning within normal limits. Can you see it? Can you see this happening for your child? What would that do for him or her? Caleb changed his brain and transformed himself using his own brain muscles and learned how to focus and pay attention through the power of neuroplasticity. This is a permanent change that he will maintain so we can continue to pay attention and get things done without continuing the exercises. What about you? Would you like this for your child? If you would, click on the link below to schedule an appointment with us today.